Yo, what is good everybody and thank you so much for stopping by the channel once again from us over here at Locust Wild Honey. So as you probably already read in the title description or the thumbnail of today's video, we're going to be taking a look at the Nike Stussy Air Zoom Spiridon. This pair is the latest offering from Nike in tandem with the OG of streetwear, Stussy. With a very strong reception to the initial pictures being leaked, a very clean yet stand out colorway, and celebrities such as Travis Scott wearing these sneakers, these were sure to be a heavy hitter in the sneaker world. Unfortunately, as of right now, the buzz has significantly subsided as the resale market seems to be a bit oversaturated with them. Anyways, with that being said, I couldn't love them anymore. And for today's video, my hope is to convince you to feel the same way. So here are a few reasons why you shouldn't sleep on these sneakers. So hopping right on into it, the first reason why I should reconsider sleeping on these sneakers is the fact that they're pretty widely available and very, very close to retail. Now, now, as I've kind of briefly talked about, it really does seem like the sneaker market is saturated with these sneakers, given the fact that they have dropped in price precipitously as pairs started coming in to their respective owners. Needless to say, a huge supply with diminutive demand will drive the market down. This really was the case for these sneakers, which, which is to say that most people aren't actually crazy about these shoes. The, the low demand has made the sneaker pretty widely available, very, very close to retail, contingent on your size, of course. Side note, I did go for a size eight and a half and I find that it fit perfectly. I take an 8.5 in pretty much all Nikes, Jordans, and I take a size nine in all Adidas. So use me for reference. Anyways, guys, with that to say, this is a really good time to purchase these sneakers because like I said, they're very, very close to retail, which is somewhat of an anomaly nowadays in the sneaker culture. The second reason you should definitely reconsider sleeping on these sneakers is actually really, really closely intertwined to the first reason. And this is actually somewhat of an opinion of mine, but I really do sincerely believe these will be a great sneaker through the duration of summer. And in light of that fact, I can definitely see these sneakers going up in value. Value. Now, this assumption is based on a few criteria. Number one being, this is a really, really good sneaker collab. You have one of the biggest, if not the biggest sneaker brand in Nike, collaborating with one of the most well-respected streetwear brands, Stussy. You have a really, really great, simple and clean silhouette with colors that actually pop and are very, very wearable. And the comfort is actually there. So I don't see why these won't do well over the summer. And if you're sitting on these, might get you a little bit extra equity down the line. Now, switching it up onto the third reason, I kind of insinuated a little bit. These are actually really, really comfortable sneakers. Now, I'm not 100% sure what the toe box is comprised of, but I can definitely say there's a lot of elasticity to the toe box as well as breathability. Regardless of what it's comprised of, I can say for sure that the upper is very comfortable while maintaining enough rigidity for a nice, even, and stable ride. The comfort doesn't actually stop there because this translates all the way through the shoe down to the midsole and outsole. With Phylite on the forefoot giving you a nice cushiony ride, with the heel being comprised of Zoom Air, which you guys already know is a nice, durable, soft ride. For this reason, and due to the fact that I do a lot of walking through summer, I can definitely say that these are going to be go-to because they are really, really comfortable. And now for my last reason, and I know this last reason is somewhat subjective, they look really, really good to me. Now I might be alone on this island and I don't mind if I am, but this is a really, really good looking sneaker to me. I mean, apart from the fact that they do come in two very distinct and recognizable colorways and the fact that they're very, very versatile, the details on these shoes are just amazing. You have different layers of mesh and canvas that comprise a sneaker. You have an embroidered swoosh, not just on the side of the shoe, but also on the panel of the toe box. You have different canvas details along with really, really unique eyelets. The Zoom Air heel has a really, really sick exposed cage which I think is a really sick detail that many might overlook. This was a very, very well executed and designed sneaker in my opinion, 
with the details just being absolutely killer. Anyways, guys, are you convinced yet? Let me know in the comment section down below what you guys think about these sneakers. Are they a cop or are they a draw? I think it goes without question. I'm definitely a huge fan of these. I think these are gonna be perfect for those of you who have that like vintage aesthetic or if you go to shorts during the summertime. Anyways, just before I let you guys go, I did want you to know that if this video gets to 2000 likes, I will be giving a pair of these away to you guys. So comment your shoe size down below and like today's video. If and when this video gets 2000 likes, I will be picking somebody in the comment section down below to receive a pair on me. Guys, as always, thank you so much for all the support. It really means so, so much. I can absolutely say without a doubt, I do not take any of the support for granted one bit. Anyways, guys, as in every video here at Locust Wild Honey, I'm gonna say peace and be blessed.